Just look at those lollipops. I've taken a little bit of shelter just near the uh, RNL. Look at those lollipops, the 45 degrees. I mean, how much more can these possibly take with these winds if they, uh, they keep up and get any stronger? So we're just walking uh, the side of the Metropole before we hit the, uh, the promenade and uh, just driving down here. The destruction and everything I've just seen. There's all sorts, there's fences gone. There's everything everywhere. And this is gonna be a, a bad one. So we're gonna get right into the video and uh, start along the promenade, see what's, uh, see what's been going on. This is St John Square, and uh, who remembers all uh, all these uh, new fences? And you see, it's been ripped out of its roots, literally. Look at that one. How long before these last? And you can even see the uh, the wreaths. And there's hundreds of these all over the road, which I picked up yesterday. And uh, this is St John Square at the moment. So we're just walking past the uh, the wedding chapel and uh, there's a little bit of a uh, shelter here. But you see uh, the camera's going all over and you can see the lollipops, they're nearly snapping. They're nearly snapping those lollipops. This is absolutely uh, incredible scenes uh, on the promenade, early hours. And again, we've even got a uh, Fald Coast window cleaners out in these conditions. That's incredible. How brave are they on the promenade cleaning the windows? I don't know what this is, some sort of sheet of something. Look at that. There's another one just a little bit further up. And if you have a look on the, uh, the beach, the tide's uh, out. It was a uh, high tide at one o'clock. It's coming back in at one if the winds are there. But there's even a couple of um, metal detectors on the beach. Look at that one. Are they, uh, they're crazy or what? I mean, I know they're on about sort of churning the sand up and everything, but we got a couple of metal detectors on the beach in this weather. So we're just near Central Pier, and you probably won't get this on camera, but you can hear the, it's like a whistling sound um, on Central Pier where the wind is whistling through these uh, rides. So I don't think no one's going to be going on the uh, that big one at the moment. Look at that. I'll, I'll try to zoom in. I don't know if you can see one of the uh, rides, one of the, the things on the big wheel, it's spinning round itself. Look at that. Oh, is this place haunted? Or is it the wind? So look at this thing, that's come off Central Pier. What is it? Looks like it's a, it's a piece of metal of some sort. A tram stop ripped from its roots again. just some of the uh, destruction caused by uh, Storm Lillian and uh, this is just near Central Drive near Poundland and there's rubbish all over the road um, literally where bins have just been flying around look at this so the cleaners have got a, a huge clear-up job this morning and it's just street after street with mess rubbish and bags is actually incredible scenes this morning. So we are on about 7 a.m. We did come out about 6 a.m. And uh, I mean, there's glass shards. Look at this, absolutely incredible. It's all over. Uh, it's be, uh, if you do come down, it'd be very, very careful. Um, 
going all the way up to Hounds Hill. I've never seen Blackpool this dirty before. Like I say, this is a this is Hounds Hill, and you can see all over this rubbish and litter, glass bottles smashed everywhere. You see, uh, Blackpool Council are straight on the uh, straight on the job. And uh, as I've said in, uh, I think, every video, an amazing credit to them. So the camera is shaking, holding it in both hands, and it's probably really uh, bad on the mic. But we're going to have a walk through town now. So the promise start, I can't even say it, the promenade has been attacked this morning by Storm Lillian, and the winds are still very, very strong. So we're going to head up a little bit more into town. Uh, and then have a look at some of the uh, surrounding areas of Blackpool on the way back. So if you are in town, be very careful walking around. You can see all these slates, they've all been ripped off the roof. So uh, if you are in town or right near any buildings, uh, be very, very careful. So I'm just walking up near Popwell now, and I think the uh, the street cleaners have already been out, and uh, I think this is just uh, more, which is uh, flown off the bins. So uh, you can see they do an amazing job. I know it's uh, obviously you know it's all rubbish and litter. However, you can see the bins are still open. So this is where all the rubbish and debris has been flying out. It's completely ripped right through. Look at that, that's gotta be eight inches is ripped through. Oh, and this is, uh, like I said, this is in Bisbon. And you can see it's uh, all over the road. 